Hi, I'm Fargal, and today in this video we're going to look at the pros and the cons of multi-species swords for Irish dairy farms. The sword that we are in today was sown on the 25th of April. It contains four grasses, three herbs, two chicories, two clovers and one plantain. Different species bring different benefits to the sword. Species such as the legumes will be nitrogen fixing, reducing the amount of chemical end needed on the farm. Others will be deep rooting and will have the potential to be more drought resistant and have an improved mineral profile compared to monocultures as a result. These swords generally also have a higher biodiversity value than traditional swords. However, there are drawbacks to incorporating multi-species into your grazing system. Weed control can be tricky as most weed killers will kill the herbs and legumes that you originally sowed. Persistence of some plant species can also be a problem with some of the herbs dying out of the sword after 3-5 to five years. Managing these swords in a 21 day rotation system can also be challenging. The key to success with multi-species swords is to uh, keep on top of the weeds through uh, spot spraying and topping. Um, to reduce the amount of chemical end spread between the months of April and September and to extend your rotation from 21 days to 25 days in midsummer. To summarise, what can a properly managed multi-species sward do for your farm? Number one, it will reduce your chemical end fertiliser bill. Number two, it will uh, reduce your carbon footprint of the overall farm. And number three, it will increase the biodiversity on the farm.